All right, so today's adventure is an unboxing. We got a package from Go Gun USA. If you uh, if you're into the uh, pistol shooting, um, pistol modification, whatever you want to call it, um, club. You might have heard about what people are calling gas pedals on uh, on some of these semi-automatic pistols. And uh, today we're going to talk about the 320, and then what Go Gun USA has, what's called the gas pedal. You can go to their website, Go Gun USA. I got it pulled up, and uh, they talk about the gas pedal. And uh, go ahead and. Check the pistol. All right, it's clear. <clears throat> so when we talk about gas pedals, we're talking about the slide lever lock, and there's a mod that extends it out where it is a, uh, a thumb index positioning when you shoot. Um, so when you're, when you're holding your pistol, right, on that, that place here, it gives you a better index point. The problem with that is if you're a lefty like me, it's not on the pistol on the right side. Um, so some pistols, for a left-handed person, this uh, it'd be a moot point not to uh, to install one. Uh, in my opinion, I, w I would never install one on the uh, the right side since I'm a lefty. Um, but for the 320 with a slide cut, it's actually got a ambidextrous slide cut so uh, Go Gun USA has a left-handed gas pedal for the 320 and if you check their website they may have some other options as well I'm not sure um, but again uh, Go Gun USA here's kind of a picture it shows the gas pedal if you uh, if you go to YouTube <clears throat> and look up the gas pedal you will uh, see some YouTube videos as well some people might think they're a gimmick but I can tell you shooting a right-handed pistol right-handed with a gas pedal uh, it did help me stay on target. It did help me uh, to deliver controlled groups a little bit easier. And again, this is the this is the instructions it comes with. We're gonna kind of go over it and look at it, and then it comes with the the gas pedal. Gas bell side, slide lever lock. Looks like a set screw as well. Okay. All right. So slide is off. All right. I pulled the the lever out. There's a set screw that keeps both pieces together. And that set screw needs to be removed. Okay. Okay. And then you can see it, right? Remove the set screw. Alright. Once I remove the set screw, we're gonna put it back in this place. Okay. See it? Then I'm going to mount this onto it, okay? and then that way I got to make sure that it's right because so when this side is locked this way, you should have your gas pedal wing facing up like that. Huh? So, 
We'll do that with the Allen wrench. Uh -huh. All right. All right. Then, as you can see, gas pedal, slide lock. All right, gas pedal, slide lock. Okay? Right. So this is what we're looking like with the gas pedal installed. I can get a better profile. It'll focus in. Yep, my uh, my red dot is cracked. I'm waiting on my uh, SIG return authorization now. But that is the Go Guns USA Thumb Index for the SIG P320. All right, so when asked about does it fit the holster, when I initially put it in the holster, it did. Um, bulge it just a little bit and then what I did was I just took a heat gun and I kind of formed it where it gives me room now and it I mean it, it holds the pistol in place and then when I need to pull it out you have to forgive me because I'm doing this one-handed but if I draw it it comes out right but that's kind of the clearance I made for it just with a heat gun and, uh, and it locks in place. Uh, unfortunately, there's not going to be any shooting on this video because it is negative 5 degrees outside and it's almost negative 20 some with the wind chill. And I am not messing with it out there. <laughs> but again, thanks for watching.